So I created a really lightweight method of evading moving threats for flying robots like this by drawing inspiration from what fruit flies do when you try to swat them. Uh, so one, thing, one of the things that makes fruit flies so good at escaping is, is their rudimentary visual system. It's actually equivalent to a 25 by 25 pixel camera. Um, and so given that they're able to process the information very, very quickly. Uh, so they actually have the fastest visual system on Earth. And that's really advantageous in, in things like escape because they're able to pick up motion and react to that very quickly. Uh, so along those lines, I designed this really lightweight sensing solution to estimate uh, the position and orientation of an approaching threat. Uh, so as a threat approaches, this bounces beams of infrared light uh, to, to find distances. Um, and then using that, I create uh, a motion model of how the threat moves over time. Uh, and then based on that, I can predict when it will reach the quadrotor um, above each sensor to rea react to that. And I react using fruit fly beha escape behaviors. I'm meant to represent a threat. Uh, this is what I've been using in experiments. And so in the context of a fruit fly, uh, that would be a fly swatter, right? They have to escape from that very quickly. Um, and then for these robots, that could be, you know, during a search and rescue mission, it could be a collapsing ceiling uh, or different falling objects that they have to escape from within a few hundred milliseconds. So it's really important for them to escape from those, uh, and that's something that they're not able to do without this.